Hi, I'm Mel and welcome back or welcome to my channel. If you are new, please subscribe and I thank each and every one of you who has subscribed so far and if you do today, I thank you too. So in today's video, really this is a stationery haul or a mini stationery haul um, and I want to share this with you now. It will be handy for people start restarting school for the next year or college, university. Uh, but for myself, I use a lot of stationery for my blogging and vlogging um, and day-to-day -day planning my life, basically. Everything is from Sainsbury's except for one thing, which is from Accessorise. Well, actually, it was an outfit, but it's from Accessorise. Um, and I'm going to share with you all of this now. Um, and so, let's begin. So, the first thing I found is kind of like a, from a collection, which I loved. Um, and so the first thing I've got is this A5 notebook. It's just lined paper inside, um, navy blue with rose gold stars, and it says hopes, dreams, and wishes. Like I said, it's just lined paper inside. Um, I think this was only a couple of pound it was only a couple of pound and there was a uh, offer on which got me 10 percent extra off and it's 192 pages um i just love the uh, print on it and like the collection is all like that uh if you have been paying attention to my other videos you'll see that i am back home in my own flat like apartment um and my living room slash kitchen Come dining room is navy blue grey and purple so this really this theme ties in well and I've got my desk in there where I do do my editing and stuff so this range is very helpful this is going to probably be I'm not sure yet I want to use one as like a journal bullet journal wise um, and, and then I've got others here too so the next thing, I'll do all of that bit first and we'll go on to the other stuff. So the next one I have got is the same collection from Sainsbury's, 192 pages, a four notebook and this is written in the stars. Again, I just love the print, how it goes so well with my um, cupboards and um, the theme in my living room. This one I am probably going to use as my bullet journal with the littler one for ideas. May completely switch that round, I'm not really sure. But if I'm writing blogs, I just use pages on my MacBook um, to jot down ideas and write stuff. But I wanted to, if I'm out and about, that's why I think the A5 size is handy just having my um, bag just to write down ideas that is what I would use that one for with this one being my journal and then the final well there's another thing from this but the final thing that is in the same navy blue and rose gold theme is this which says hopes dreams and wishes and this is a weekly planner I'll have this on the windowsill by my desk and write out everything um, I, I plan to do this video so in the next few weeks you'll probably see it um, as I have been blogging a lot about it anyway I wanted to do something for my vlog for my YouTube channel so I'm going to map out everything I need to do and achieve in each day and then make sure I do it by following it because I follow something written down more than I do from my memory it's probably for pure laziness but I like to have it written down and I just love how cute this is this planner is gorgeous they had other ones in Sainsbury's if you want different but they um, I just love the, again the uh, rose gold and navy blue so that's why I picked this one the two notebooks are lined paper and the planner is obviously every day of the week with lines where you can write what you have to get done in that day um, maybe well, you'll see it in a video coming up, hopefully, if not, you know, yeah. And then the final thing from that range I got was this cute little bottle of rose gold paper clips. Um, 
obviously if you got the planner as well and the notebooks you could use them for school and you could plan out what you needed homework done by what day and everything like that so that's why i've included the planner but i needed a planner in for me anyway so i just loved that so these paper clips um are super cute i love the they're in a jar and they're rose gold to tie in with the theme and they um will sit cutely on my desk that's why i got these Okay, so that's all really about the rose gold and navy blue theme as such. So the next thing I got was these 10 uh, eraser tip pencils. Half are pink and half are purple. Half are pink and half are blue. I just think if you're writing notes or jotting down stuff if you're not 100% sure on it write it in pencil um i think that is good to write in pencil as well as pen um also if you're making notes that you need to then rub out this is perfect for them okay so the next thing i got was these 400 sticky notes like post-it notes from sainsbury's i nearly fell off the bed and they are multicolored. So these will be handy for um, noting what, what and when I want to do for YouTube. And because I'm a bit slacking in that, so I need to refresh and make sure that I'm more organized. Um, again, with my blog, because obviously it ties together, Tuesdays and Sundays are blog posts on www.melaniekate.co.uk. And Wednesdays and Saturdays are vlogs like videos so it's quite busy and then obviously I post on Instagram every day so that's why I just need to have a planner and organize my life because I love doing this but I also have a full-time job so I need to just be organized to get this to be to work and be successful for myself so I am it's just amazing but i need to do this for this so that's why i've got these so i can make plan out all videos stick them around the house if i have to so i remember what to do and when and then the next thing i have got are these 10 big um biros i'm kind of strange like i've mentioned before in my paper gang video so i only like writing on one side of the paper but also I only like writing in navy blue ink other than that I don't really like writing in blue or any other colour I don't mind as much in my bullet journal because that is meant to be creative and um, bright and cheerful and get you in the in the mood to do it basically but for every day to day things it's either got it's got to be navy blue ink um, so these bics come in handy and also I quite often take them to work and lose them or lose them somewhere in my handbag because my handbag's massive at the moment. So yeah, I love these bics and that's why I've got these and then I will probably use the bics mostly um, along with the pencils. But also for the pencils, I've just remembered this, for the pencils to write in the planner that's quite good because obviously if you're still at school and you've done homework and if you achieve or finish more on one night you can obviously if you wanted to get ahead you could do more on that night so you can swap it around a bit so that's why pencil is good for the planner and then the last thing i got from sainsbury's is these paper main pens ink joy i'm going to open them but this is the packaging and they're tiny they're minis and i'm going to try and oh, open them now see what they're like so yeah these are like by V2 and they're just multicolored so they're really good to have in your handbag um, or in your school bag obviously in your pencil case and they're good for bullet journaling because you can literally jot down whatever you want when you want so this is perfect for them and it just makes it all creative because they're mini they're easier to have in a bag um, and obviously for school if you well yeah I guess you had well we had to used to write in um, blue pen or black pen and it most of the time had a fountain pen 
is that still a thing if you go back if you're still in school do you write in a fountain pen or just write in biro please let me know but we used to have to write in a bar in a fountain pen most of the time so yeah these are cool though and i thought these were really handy to have and just to make fun notes and a bit of color in your life does does cheer you up so they're perfect and then finally i actually got these first because i was um up at my local shopping center uh actually i've been there both days this weekend but never mind um and the outfit had swapped all of its shops around and got two or three new shops in it um so obviously one b it was accessorized and I've seen quite a lot of people at work have the like post-it notes like these but like half the size as like bookmarks and I could use mine at work because I have my own work labelled ones to do that but where I'm learning a new job and learning new things most days I find it would find it easier if I had like the tabs on them to know what page was what and I thought these were super cute so these are from Accessorize you can get them at Accessorize you don't have to get them an outfit but i was an outfit and these are cat page markers i just think these are super cute and i want to just put tab them on um to where i am in a book or like writing and um at work even and here at home um or even like in my bag ones because i carry i've got i think i've got three <laughs> notebooks in my bag purely for things i'm working on and have to make notes of and i have like my diary and stuff like that in there so that is it that is all i've brought so that is it for today's video if you liked it please give it a big thumbs up please comment down below your favorite a bit of say stationery if you're at school or college university do you have to take your own stationery with you so eat that's including books and stuff like that um or do you have them supplied to you i when i was at school we had them supplied to us college when i went to fashion college i'm pretty sure we weren't supplied with them i'm sure we had to buy them and we had folders full of fabric swatches and stuff like that um so please yeah let me know if you have to buy stationery or not and what is your favorite type of stationery do you have a favorite color or do you have a theme to all your stationery or do you just go with whatever you can find please also subscribe push the notification bell to see when i post and thanks for watching bye